Hey family, so welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe so you can be notified every time I upload a video and put on your post notification so you don't miss it, okay? So you know exactly when. And like, like it, like it, like it, like it because that brings traffic to the channel and it's not for me, it's for the Lord so that people can see what's going on right now because it's real crazy out here in these spiritual streets. So make sure you comment too, you know, show your girl some love. Show your girl some love, okay? This is all love on my channel, so you know what I'm saying? Exchange the love, okay? Spread it, let it go viral, okay? So we gonna get into it. So, y'all, let me tell y'all what's going on right now. So, okay, I'm being mad extra, but the spirit is excited right now as I'm talking about it. Y'all, <laughs> so I was like hesitant about putting this video out because it's just so much going on in the spirit, but I'm going to just do it anyway because the Lord loves when I talk about him and I love talking about him. So anyway, in a dream, by the way, this is about the Lord. And if you don't know, the reason why my name is Queen Nina of Nazareth is because I'm the bride of Christ, Revelation 12 woman. My son is going to come rule all nations with a rod of iron. When will that be? Who knows? Because I can't tell y'all. Y'all just gonna see a baby pop up out of nowhere. So, so my rock could pop up with a baby like <laughs> top of all the nations. But anyway, so in this dream, the Lord was talking to me, and we were in a classroom, and I didn't hear nothing the teacher was saying, and I was so sad. And I remember I was rubbing my belly, sitting down. So then Jesus, He took my seat that I was sitting in. He took my seat and he swung it over to him so that we're facing each other. And as we're facing each other, he was talking to me. And I was so sad and I was just rubbing my stomach. And that was symbolic because I, like sometimes I get in this mood where I'm so upset that he's not here so much to the fact that like I let it take over and the spirit of sadness comes on sometimes because I'm like, Jesus, like, don't you see that I'm just ready for you to come? Like, I just, I want you. Like, that's all I need right now is you. And the Lord was telling me that I need to lean on him more because that's just hurting me. You know what I mean? So I'm so focused on the fact that he's not here that I'm not hearing what I'm supposed to be hearing. Or we're not going further in our relationship we're not moving forward okay because you're supposed to move forward you're supposed to elevate spiritually just like you're supposed to elevate in a natural but it's like if i keep doing it i'm gonna be stuck so that's what the lord was telling me like stop focused on the fact that i'm not here and getting your word more keep staying in your word don't be sad you know like not that i wasn't getting the word but it's like it came to a point where i'm reading the word and i'm crying like i'm upset like i'm just like I get to a verse that reminds me of him and I'm like, oh my gosh, like, this is just too much. Like, I just can't. But anyway, that was that. But the Lord, he was sharing me stuff about him, right? So he said, and I, I just, I feel like this is important to get out because it just shows how human he is. Like, yes, he's our savior. Yes, he's the king of kings, Lord of lords, Alpha and Omega. Ain't nobody greater. Like, he's just amazing, right? Um, plus more undescribable. Like, there's no limit to how amazing he is. But y'all get me. He's still a human. And so he was telling me, he was like, barbecue. And I was like, barbecue? And he was like, it's delicious. Like, he loves barbecue. So barbecue chicken, barbecue ribs. Like, he loved him some barbecue. And he also says strawberry. That's his favorite fruit. So yes, he has favorite things. Like, and the, the religious spirit will be like, God made all things, so he should love everything equally. You're a liar. <laughs> no. He has favorites. Um, favorite food, that's what it was. And yeah, um,